the internet. Does anyone remember beepers? Because I do, and I had one, and they were super cool, but now I find them to be the most useless thing that has ever been created. It was the kind of little gadget that came before texting, before cellular phone, before everything. This was our first person-to-person -person communication when you're out and about device thing. That's a technical term, okay? Ah, the beeper. Such a weird little status product. I can't believe we actually communicated like that. Weird little series of numbers we would send each other with 123s and 911s and 411s and 143s that all meant different little things. Because really, that was the only way that you can communicate. There was no way for you to punch in, hey, meet me over here or anything like that. All you could do is leave your phone number and maybe a code or something. This is a little gadget where the only thing that I can do is tell you where to call me, what number to call me. I can't tell you when to call me, I can't tell you why to call me, I can't, I can't give you anything but a series of numbers. Plus, you calling back depends entirely on your vicinity to a phone or to spare change so that you can call me on a payphone. Of course, if you were really baller, you had that brick-sized cellular phone that you can call people on, but why would you have a pager if you had a phone? Do you know what I mean? So the thing that I found funny about this is that if you receive a beep, a page, whatever you want to call it, how are you supposed to call back? All you have is this beeper. You don't have a cell phone. They don't really exist yet. I like sound guards. They're like the best ever, man. But, you know, oh, oh, oh. Yeah, my girl just paged me. I think I have to call her back. How are you gonna call her back? Do you have Do you have a quarter for the payphone? No, I no, I don't. I don't. I don't have. A, I I don't have a quarter. Do you, Do you have a quarter? Quarter? Or, Why would I have a quarter? I don't have a quarter. Beeper. No. Hmm. Uh. Yeah. Damn it. Do you guys remember what a payphone is? Maybe I'll cover that in another episode. Hey folks, what were you thinking, beeper makers? That we should all have a couple of quarters in our pockets just in case someone paged us with a 911 code afterwards so that we can rush to a payphone and call them or that we were just gonna idly sit by. Now with our newfound freedom to roam, we were just supposed to sit at home so that we're close to our, our telephones and be able to call our friends or loved ones that just paged us. So it's, a, it's amazing to me how much technology I've seen in my lifetime. Um, you know, seeing going from nothing at all to seeing beepers flourish to seeing the two ways which I never had and then my first cell phone which was a Nokia and and then on and on and on and on to today where we have all these crazy crazy gadgets and devices for anything that we really want to do I can't be parted with my technology very easily and as a, as a matter of fact all of my notes for this episode were written in my phone and I'm using them now. <laughs> I can't be parted with my phone for too long. You see, what I find odd is that I used to take this beeper with me to school. For what? For what reason did I take it with me to school? Everyone that was gonna page me was in class with me. No one, no one was gonna call you. No one was gonna call you while you were in school. They wouldn't call you when you were out of school, if they called you at all. I obviously only had it as like a little status gadget and only so that I could show off that I owned one. I wonder how it is now with all these iPhones and iPods and things like that. Now they could actually call from the class to their locker to their friend in the cafeteria. <laughs> Makes sense now, didn't make sense then with the beavers. I'm Billy Barracuda, this has been the Sunday Blog and I'll see you next week internet. Same. Time and place, maybe not time, you know, I'm always late and stuff, okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, okay, I'm sorry, it was the Super Bowl, it was the Super Bowl, okay?